Hey guys, I'm Lisa for WTF Lisa Tarot, and I get messages through songs. So when you're bed in, when you're bed out, like, share, subscribe, follow, drop a tip, cash app, WTF Lisa Tarot. Show my, <coughs> show my stories. That was beautiful. WTF Lisa eBay and WTF Lisa Tarot at dot com. Hi, Leo. You feisty sons of bitches with your lying ass motherfucking ways. I have age, age. That's not right. Let me start that over. And then she said, I begin again in my ear when I said, let me start over. <laughs> I have Edge of 17 by uh, Stevie Nicks. The energy I get around you guys, Leo, right now is immaturity. I don't feel like any, I, I, it's just immaturity. Now, some of you, you have children. And that's just going to be the way it is for a while because you are raising children. <laughs> some of you, you actually work with children. That's just the, the reality of your life. And some of you are handling it very well, but you know, of course you need breaks too. Everyone does. Uh, but for others around you, the immaturity is from adults. So if it, you have children or work with kids, let's leave that to the side because this energy, just like the white wing dove, sing song sounds like she's singing. Ooh, baby, ooh, I said ooh. Some of you though, Again, let's leave anything with children aside because this feels like immature adults, whether in work, love, life, family, the fucking neighborhood. Some of you are over some people's shit. A small percentage, some people are over your shit and you got to deal with that. But this energy more is for the larger collective of Leos who are tired of putting up with some immature bullshit. Some of you, it's like you're kind of stuck with it as in maybe you work for a corporation or company. That they make dumb decisions, there's nothing you can do about it. Why? Because you, you're just an employee. You, you can't, I mean, a corporate makes a decision. There's nothing you can do. And a lot of you have just kind of resigned yourself to that. Well, most corporations, if it doesn't make, if, if it makes sense, then don't do it is their vibe. Uh, <clears throat> but for others of you with things you can control, friendships, certain coworkers, it's like, yeah, you're stuck with them, but you can try to avoid them as much as you can and just stick to your work. Some of you are just over that immature, full page of coins attitude. Some of you nine of coins. It is at work. Empress. You maybe you have a boss of sorts. Also, some of you have a coworker who steals your ideas, or it's just like they're always lurking, trying to see what you're up to. And to, it just feels like they're trying to always. And strength, Leo. This is your own energy. Uh, some of you, you're just over it. You do have lurky co-workers or someone always up your ass. Like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Leo, 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 Leo. And you're just like, judgment. Oh, my fucking God. It's an immature energy, but someone's always, like, bugging you. It's also leg humper energy. I just get this energy of uh, Leo. You're just feeling right. Edge of 17, she's saying in my ear. But the energy, King of Pentacles, is you're over here trying to, to be your fine Leo asses. King of Pentacles. But then everyone around you is like, Leo. Look at me, Leo. I'm going to hump your leg, Leo. And you're just like, ah, I'm going to bite your head off. I'm a fucking lion, bitch. Go over there. It's an immature energy and trying to keep your, like, trying to keep your cool without letting the lion explode. Because, uh, like, a lot of you are cool as a cucumber, but you have your boiling points, too. Your fire signs, your lions. And it almost feels like someone is purposely... Trying to, like, grind your fucking gears or get you to slip up, almost, in some cases. It's like they feeds their fucking fuel to piss off a Leo. But that's not a good idea to piss off a Leo. Six of Swords, Ten of Wands. Because, son, there's your energy again. Do they really want to hit that fucking nerve? I don't think they do. And I think some of you... Like I said, you're cool as a cucumber. So you'll, you're willing to say, hey, buddy... You're about to cross, you know, however way you talk, man. You're crossing the line. You don't want to hit that fucking nerve. And someone's like, oh, I do want to hit that nerve. And then they do hit that nerve. And they're surprised. But some of you, you can tell somebody is trying to hit a nerve. So you're just, just like, whatever, man. And just playing it cool. Like, you're not giving them the satisfaction. You know exactly what they're doing. I hear you in the morning. And I hear you in the nightfall. <laughs> yeah, I know what you're saying, buddy, and I'm just not playing your fucking game. Some of you, magician, four of wands, knight of cups, you just know six, this person, ace of wands, always over and over, fucking idiot. So with this three of coins, four of coins, will, I feel like in some cases you're just ignoring because 
with this wheel devil they don't learn i'm a few years older than you some of you it is co-workers friends family members maybe as a sibling <clears throat> in some cases i'm getting some of you as a fucking immature sibling and they're in trouble again and they want hey i got into a fight with a clown at a rodeo there were midgets and popcorn and confetti can you help me again and they're like you're fucking 43 knock it off Six of Swords, Page of Wands, the Lovers, Two of Cups. Somebody just, again, it's like High Priest. They want something from you, but Ace of Swords, you're done. Eight of Wands. <coughs> I pushed Matchbox 20, Matchbox 20, which I haven't heard this song in a while. I'm a little bit rusty, but it's whatever it is. You're tired of immature behavior. You're done. Some of you, you're just trying to keep it cool until a situation dies down, but someone really is trying very hard to annoy the piss out of you. 